Yo, what's poppin' YouTube? You already know who it is. It's the Dreadhead, the gamer here, Mel Too Nasty. And what I got for you guys today is a simple little video, quick video. Um, it's a TDM on Arden's Forest. Um, not too crazy. I go on a big streak um, throughout the video. So I hope you guys enjoy. But what I got to talk to you guys about today is the state of... Like the, like the state of Call of Duty, like from my eyes. Um, I'm going to try not to like drag it on too long, but I, this might even turn into like a fucking rant video. I don't know, but I just feel like it's time out for Activision and all these fucking Call of Duty developers to stop feeding us bullshit. Like, if you play COD and you've played this year's COD, then you probably can agree with me that this is the worst COD launch ever. The game came out exactly a month ago, and it is the worst, it has been the worst COD launch ever to me. Like, and I don't understand that because, like what, four years ago? Yeah, I think four years ago or three years ago, they started a three-year cycle, meaning three different developers make Call of Duty now. So we got Treyarch, Infinity Ward, and Sledgehammer. Now, it's always said, ever since this has been a thing, it's always been said that all these games take three years to, you know, develop, create, put into play, perfect, all that shit. Well... What I want to understand is, if it's taking three years for these games to develop, why the fuck are they so trash, bro? Like, like, like again, if I say, if you play COD, you can understand and you can relate to this shit. Ghost, everybody gives Ghost a bad rep because how people play Ghost and the maps are so big. Ghost was not a bad game at all. Ghost wasn't a bad game. But just because the community talks shit about ghosts, we just, you know, we're going to exclude ghosts. The last great game, a great COD game, was Black Ops 2. That's when it only took, you know, Infinity Ward made a game, Treyarch made a game, Infinity Ward made a game, Treyarch made a game. How in the fuck is the games that's taken less time to make better than the games that it's apparently or quote unquote taking more time to make if you got three years to make a video game and then you make a beta put out a beta two weekends of a beta if you do that how the fuck can you send out a finished product that has glitches on top of glitches. Even after the beta, bugs on top of bugs. People can barely play in parties. People can only use one perk. And you can't play the game without that one perk or your aim is just gonna fucking go everywhere when you get shot. I'm, I'm referring to Prime and the flinch mechanic in this game. Now, as of right now, most of this shit has been fixed. You can play in the party. You don't have to get kicked to the main menu after every game. There was even stat loss in this game because the matches, some of the matches you were doing, you weren't getting credit for. So technically, nobody has their full day one stats. Nobody. If you play during launch weekend or even up until the last couple patches, you don't have your complete day one stats. You, they could be worse. They could be better. But my thing is, why is that happening? It's taking so long for these developers to make the game. What the fuck are they working on? If it takes them three years to come out with a fucking COD game, what are they putting their work into that is taking them so long to make these games, but the games that they make are shit? 
Now we, it was the same thing for IW. It took them, quote unquote, three years. Motherfucker, they gave us a goddamn beta for a full game. Like, the story campaign, so I heard I didn't play it, but the story campaign was 75% of the game, bro. Like, it's like they spent all their time on campaign and then they just threw whatever in the multiplayer. And that's what this shit feels like here recently. Ever since COD has transitioned to this three year to make a Call of Duty shit, the only good COD that came from that was Black Ops 3. And Black Ops 3 didn't have that many issues, honestly. Black Ops 3 wasn't, you know, that bad of a COD game. It wasn't bad at all. I just don't fuck with the whole jetpack and shit, whatever. But that's another story for another day. I'm just on some shit, like, I'm tired of being finessed. I'm tired of paying 60, 70 bucks for games that really aren't finished. And then we got to wait one month into the game, two months into the game for them shits to be finished. Hell, IW last year, bro, they didn't have leaderboards until one to two months in. I think it might have been longer than that. Like, what the fuck kind of shit is that? How can you say fuck your fans like that? Fuck your community like that? I don't understand that shit. I will never get that shit. So if you have an opinion or if you have some type of understanding to share with me, please leave that down in the comment section below. Like I said, this was probably going to turn into a rant video, and it did. But if you agree with me or you got you know input, please drop it down in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like. Also, remember to comment down. And if you're new to the channel, thank you so much for watching. It's been the Dreadheaded Gamer, Mel Too Nasty. Much love. Peace out.